Putting in this type of system will be a game changer for the hospital and it should be a game changer for cancer therapy. It really represents yet another step of how this medical center is continuing to, to sit on the leading edge of, of cancer therapy. This will help us in delivering the most cutting edge technology, the best care for our patients, um, and you know they can get it all here uh, close to home. What was just a dream a decade ago is now reality as the S. Lee Kling Proton Therapy Center is fighting cancer like never before in the St. Louis area. Until now, patients with certain kinds of cancers have been required to travel at least 200 miles, sometimes farther, to get proton therapy, a special radiation treatment that beams protons right at a cancerous tumor and nowhere else. The proton beam enters a patient and can go to a desired depth. We know from imaging that a tumor, maybe that proton dose needs to go five inches deep and it can stop at five inches and it doesn't pass beyond that. So the advantage of protons is that you can spare normal tissues that are around a patient's tumor. That's different than traditional radiation, which passes through the tumor and can damage otherwise healthy tissue. So proton therapy is especially important for patients with head, neck, and spinal cord cancers, as well as children. This is something that is unique internationally for now, and certainly unique in the St. Louis area. And why it is so special, because it is an additional form of radiation therapy delivery that has an enormous advantage because of the precision we're able to do to deposit dose exactly where we want it to go and giving nothing to critical organs. That's of great excitement for many sites, but especially for brain tumors and especially in children because of their normal developing brain and the effects that radiation has on that. The S. Lee Kling Proton Therapy Center is one of just a dozen treatment centers across the country now delivering this critical cancer care and the only one in the world to do it in such a small space. The Mevion S250 generates protons through an entirely new process, delivering in one room what other facilities do in four and at a fraction of the cost. The remarkable technology has healthcare facilities around the world watching what happens here, and it started a landslide of groundbreaking developments in cancer treatment. This is the first proton therapy system that has the cyclotron rotating around the room. This is the first proton therapy system that has a robotic couch with six degrees of freedom to move the patient around to the right position. Uh, this is the first proton therapy system in the United States with a CT scanner in the room, making sure that we localize that patient's tumor exactly each day prior to treatment. We have a six-dimensional robotic couch. It actually is, works like a robot. It's programmed to do very complex things. For example, it, will, it can weigh the patient every day and see how much deflection there might be at the table. And we're talking about changes on the order of millimeters and tenths of degrees. That kind of pinpoint precision is critical to patients who have tumors in the head, neck, and spine, including the late S. Lee Kling, who the Proton Center is named after. The former board chair of the foundation for Barnes Jewish Hospital needed proton therapy and had to travel across the country to get it. Mr. Kling worked tirelessly for the proton center until his death in 2008. Wouldn't you, if you had a problem like this or you had a child that had a problem or a mother or father, wouldn't you love to be able to bring that patient here to Barnes Jewish to have that treatment and be able to save that person's life here in St. Louis in a comfortable environment with the very best doctors involved. Even though this groundbreaking proton center is an important new piece in the complex puzzle of cancer care, it's just one part of the comprehensive personalized treatment program at the Seitman Cancer Center at Barnes Jewish Hospital and Washington University School of Medicine. The cutting edge tools, individualized treatment plans, clinical trials, and world-class physicians combine to make Siteman a national leader in cancer. We have all the resources here to bring this first of its kind unit into the clinic and do some amazing research with it. But behind that, you know, we have to have the anesthesiologist, 
the nurses, the medical oncologists, surgeons, and we have all of that here. We have such a strong program and it's really exciting to, to be able to deliver the very best care. It really represents uh, yet another step of how this medical center is continuing to sit on the leading edge of cancer therapy. This is obviously a great moment. We don't expect this to be the last great advancement at this institution. The Siteman Cancer Center at Barnes Jewish Hospital and Washington University School of Medicine. National leaders in cancer.